17 year old boy is now accused in a vandalism spree in Plymouth. That targeted a number of historical monuments, including Plymouth Rock. The crews were able to clean up the red spray paint, but it still angered many who found it incredibly disrespectful. Christina Rex is in Plymouth tonight with more on the outrage and relief that the vandal was found. Police say surveillance video helped them discover who was behind the red spray paint all over historical landmarks in town. And now a high school student faces felony charges. Faint marks of red paint still visible on Plymouth Rock. I thought it was so sad because Plymouth is such a wonderful town. We're so proud of our history and heritage. Ten days ago, the rock and ten other historical monuments around town were splattered with the mysterious phrase 508 MOF and anti police graffiti. The vandalism just months before the Plymouth 400th anniversary celebration ignited residents. Absolutely. I mean, they're historic monuments and landmarks, and, you know, we have people that come from everywhere to come see them. Why would somebody do that? That somebody, police say, was a 17-year-old Plymouth South High School student. Simply a young juvenile making a poor judgment call. The teen now faces one misdemeanor and 11 felony vandalism charges, bringing a sense of closure and confusion to those who love their historic town. I feel bad for him because for him to do something like that, I, and he must be a little screwed up and he needs some help. Police haven't released that 17-year-old's name because of his age, and they say at this point they still don't know why he might have done this. In Plymouth, Christina Rex, WV News.